Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. It snowed again don't last let night. It trick you. It's still very slippery. Yeah, don't let it trick you, Sophie said. It's still very slippery. It is glorious out here, you guys. Absolutely beautiful, stunning, amazing. I wonder if I could ride today. <laughs> We have things to do, but I want to ride. There's nothing better than a fresh fallen snow. Fresh fallen snow, dogs and horses. Good morning, Penny. She's peeing. Imagine you were the kind of person that got so excited every time you saw somebody you loved that you peed. Yeah, that's what she does. She's a peeing horse. Anyway, good morning. Whoops. Anyway, good morning. Welcome to today's video. Gabby is on her way. And we, I'm excited for today. Sometimes I just wake up and I'm excited. For, I, feed, ah. I feed this one, he feeds me. Sometimes I just wake up and I'm excited for today. Yeah, Sophie took my horse. He took my horse. Hold on, back it up. Gotta be careful when you feed this one because she headbutts you. Poof, concussion. That one never gives you a concussion. It is glorious outside. Brandon says it's supposed to be like so cold tomorrow. Our arena is a mess because when the weather's bad, Sam feeds the horses inside and he overfeeds them. So they are overfed. There's hay everywhere. Like, can't even find good help, you guys. Ooh, can't even find good help, but that's okay. At least we have help. <laughs> Us girls. And it's not that we're lazy, you guys. It's not that the girls and I are lazy. It's that we're doing other things. Like, the girls are doing school and I'm cleaning and organizing and teaching and yeah that's my excuse and i'm no. sticking to it are we ready nobody's answering me but we're ready out you go little muffin out you go little muffin out you go princess hold on let me get your eye clean I always clean you first instead of sending you out like a ragamuffin. Like, who buys dirty girl horses? Laura. Laura likes her a dirty girl horse. <laughs> oh, a girl after my own heart. Can't be looking perfect, can we? No, hold on. Wait. 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 Okay. A trip. That's my girl. Right, good girls. It's nice out, eh? <laughs> I'm like, it's nice out, isn't it? Gabby's like, it's freezing, and I want to go up. I want to go up too. Did you know what your dad? That your dad was allowed to stay home from work till 10 o'clock this morning, and he left at 5:30. So he didn't have to do chores. He's smart, smarter than we thought. I'm sweating. I'm sweating too. <laughs> All right, we got too many, too much stuff going on. We got people sweating, people freezing, people bored, people who want to leave, people who want to go up. Like, it's a lot, man. It's a lot this early in the morning. It's 8 a.m. 8 a.m. and the sky is looking gorgeous. One pony down. Uh oh. Uh oh. You see that? Penny is Penny is really not that nice. Penny Pickle. Poor Willow. Sam told the girls to break the water out of there. Poke a hole in the bucket, dump it into Penny's water. Poke a hole in the bucket, dump it into Penny's water because Penny's doesn't freeze. And take their buckets up to the house to thaw. All right. Thaw? Because I'm going to empty it? Yeah, see it hardly froze last night, eh? Or it's just the hammer. I don't like putting metal in, in water though. Sam doesn't do like thorough cleanings. He just kind of does whatever we have to get done. So whenever I'm at the barn, I try and do a more thorough cleaning, like clean the arena, clean muscles. the, do so much, but today is not that day. And I think I'd have muscles. I woke up with energy, but not energy for wow. barn chores. Do you guys remember these? 
These were what we used for our bunnies, and now they're all dusty and gross. I'm gonna take them up to the house and clean them. Sophie and I have a project for them, but this bucket is super heavy, way heavier than it should be. So either something in here is frozen, or there's something in here we don't need. Look at how gorgeous it is out there. I told you guys that, that Sophie has been uh, trying to rearrange her room. It is not finished yet. It's not even close to being finished yet. Sophie, it's not even close to being finished. I don't care. <laughs> she doesn't care. She's going to show you. We're going to show you guys a little tiny bit. We'll show you the parts that we've finished. So, um, we did... <laughs> we finished this section, although her bed is not made. This is a bad room tour because... <laughs> kind of made. It is made. All right, so this is Gab Sophie's bed section. She's got her TV here, and she can sit there and watch TV, lay in bed and watch TV. This is where we've been hanging out lately because it's really cozy and comfy and yes, warm up here. I have been having more excuses. It's just really same. warm. Yeah, that's exactly it. There's it. warm air coming out of the bed for one sec. For one second. <laughs> Gabby says her room is cold, but all the rest of our rooms I was are like, hot. I just pointer finger but then I didn't realize that it was being covered. <laughs> <laughs> You're so um, weird. For uh, one second and then cold air comes out of it. You know why oh, my room is so hot? Why? Because my um, closet is basically uh, heat. a heating vent. Yeah it is so hot in here but anyway this is her little section that fan. we already finished. I showed you the other day and so today I have my fan. yeah we have a fan oh, because it is it, too it's too hot. This is her little wall. We showed you this yeah, the other day. Yeah, all the cold air transfers to my room. Yeah, all the heat comes here. All right, just wait, hold on. So uh, the other thing that we're working on right now is this section, and we're not finished, clearly, but she has like a big room. Um, so we built this thing today, and we have a lot of those things left, but we ran out of these little knobby things that put it together. So we're gonna make it cold one more higher, and we're gonna make it one barely any air, but wider. Cold. Uh, anyway, we're gonna make this extra big so that she can store all her junk because she has a lot of junk A lot of stuff and then we're gonna put more bean bags in her bean bag chair because she actually likes the bean bag chair But this is like literally all we did for her room today Now when Elizabeth sleeps over, um, we can chill in our room Yeah, now when Elizabeth sleeps over, they can chill in their room Well, for Peter's on our iPad, she's being a friend, like <laughs> Yeah, because I always lose <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> Yeah, not everybody is good at cards, but also the dogs like it in here. Can't go anywhere in this house without dogs surrounding you. Yeah, we, we also play I Slack. Got food. I suck at Slack. I don't like my dogs home. Oh, that's why this is happening. Gabby's a sharer. She likes to share. No, because when when it's just one piece and they don't have cheese on it, like that, I give it to my dogs. Guys, I have a new record. I've not been on Roblox for two days. Wow. Oh my God. You guys played so much the last two weeks that you had to take a break. No, we have Roblox now. All right. So anyway, that's it so far. Come feel right here, right where I have my hand. Cold. I don't feel any air. Barely any air coming out and it's cold. <sighs> yeah, that's weird. Gabby also has 17 blankets on her bed. I see she doesn't even make her bed. This is a really heavy one. It's so thick. This is a heavy one. This is a heavy one. That, she has her stitch blanket. It looks really small, but when I put it on, it's not. Gabby found a shirt. I opened her closet and it is a mess. All her little horses in there. I just, <laughs> what? I just throw everything there. Um, one of my goals this week, or this month, this year, <laughs> is to clean out all this stuff. Just wait, I wanna show them something. Because, um, I don't know if you guys remember, but Gabby used to be, when she was like 11, addicted to polo shirts. And Sam bought her 44. She bought had 44 polo shirts. He like literally took it upon himself to make sure she had a polo shirt in every single color. Oh my gosh, Gabby, why don't you ever wear this? It's not that warm and it's a little itchy. It's so cute though. Put it away. All right, well, anyway, I'm going to go through here and I'm going to give some of our friends some of their clothes, some of her clothes. She has like nothing hung up. It's all just in a big pile. This is the stuff I wear in summer sometimes. But anyways, now she, how come you never wear your ba base layers anymore? Is it because it's too cold? I don't know. All right, let's go. Oh, so my closet. We're being kicked out of the closet, you guys. We're kicked out of the closet. <laughs> it's supposed to be freezing cold tonight and then in tomorrow. 
So I am going to take this opportunity to ride my horse. Hey, hold on. Uh oh. <laughs> Quick, Gracie, go! <laughs> because Meanie is here. Big Meanie girl. You want to go for a ride, Penny Pickle? Gotta be fair. I feel like they know we're fair now. Come here. Come here, little, little mini. No, let her have some. Here you go, little princess. Hey, don't you be a bully. It's true Penny's not like a lover. Do you know what I mean? Like, Stella loved Willow. She loved anybody who loved her. Penny loves Penny. <laughs> and that's okay. It's okay to be that horse. It's okay to be that girl. In fact, it's okay to be whoever you are. And in being whoever you are, it's also really important to let other people be who they are. We can't choose for other people. We can't decide for other people. We have to let everyone have their own journey. And to do that, you have to be secure in your own journey. Once you're secure in your own journey, other people's journeys won't make any difference to you at all. You'll be able to sit back. I forgot the saddle. I have to go back up to the house and get the saddle. I know you're disappointed. <laughs> She's disappointed. <laughs> Look at her ears. <laughs> I'll be back. Uh. Anyways, it's true. Be confident in yourself. Find security in your own journey. And once you do that, nothing anybody else does will bother you. It's so crazy. Even Mr. Ollie arrived. Hi, Ollie. He's so cute. He's no Thumper. Thumper's the gray cat at our barn. If you're wondering if why my hand is shaking, <laughs> it's because Gracie's here. Go away. Gracie, you are annoying. I love you, but you're annoying. <laughs> you like you like horses? Yeah. You like Gracie? Yeah, look how cute he is. Yeah, oh, you're such a happy boy. Look how cute. Orange cuts are good luck. Oh, you're chubby. You're so chubby. Look how cute. Oh my goodness. You're such a cute kitty. Penny. Come on, Penny. Penny. Goodbye, kitty cat. Goodbye. So uh, this is how I take Penny inside with all the other horses. It's so easy. She's so good. Watch. She just walks up. If I need her to go a little bit further, I just do. And she just stands there. I let go of the lead rope a lot. And then we go. And then she tells me if she wants to ride. <laughs> I feel like she's telling me no. Come on. Her feet might be full of ice. Problem here is the fact that Brandon told me it was going to be really cold. And of course, I believed him. But it's actually gorgeous outside and I left the stool at the barn. So now I have no way to get on. And that's a problem because I'm a chicken of getting on unless I have a stool that's tall enough. Penny, what do you think we're gonna use? I do have a stool here. She's like, I don't care, just give me food. All right, so honestly, how is this thing supposed to come out? It doesn't, it, I can't get it out. Like when I'm using two hands, I'm trying to pull this apart. It's so tight in there, I can't even get it out. Penny, I need your help. <laughs> I can't get the thing off, it's so annoying. Ah, I feel so frustrated, we might not get to ride. I feel like everything is telling me not to ride. What the heck, like, this thing is too big for this hole and I just can't get it off. I can't ride. Like literally, I've done every single thing that I can and I can't get it off, I'm so frustrated. That's so annoying, Penny Pickle. Ah. Help, <laughs> help. Ah. I really wanna ride, it's like the last day I can ride for a while. Because the weather is going to get really cold. Ah. 
try one more time. I've tried like 15 times and I can't get it. I swear so much of riding equipment is made by men. We need to make a new line of riding equipment for women. Oh, I got it. Ah! I half got it. Ah! No. I can't get it. I'm so sad. I can't believe it. I'm so sad. Penny, today is a flag day. You want to work with the flag, Penny Pickle? You want to? All right, that's what we're going to do. I know I sound like a baby, but honestly, like, only another mom that owns a horse would understand like how hard it is to get time to ride your horse when everything is right. Like you have to have time, you have to have the weather has to be right. I can't ride. Why? Because I can't get the tack fixed. What tack fixed? I can't get the, I just wanna cry. I have a headache from cry trying then. to, cry? Cry. Will you give me Kleenex? No. What will you do if I cry? Ask Kaylee. <laughs> Gabby's always a strong one for Kaylee. No, I do nothing. She's crying while I'm sleeping. Gabby's a bad friend. Yeah. <sighs> but hey. honestly, it's like... You too. Yeah. It's like, no matter how much I try, I just feel like sometimes I never get a chance to do the things that I want for me. And even though I know that that's selfish, and I try and like find joy and serving other people just like one of a time I'd like it to go well and go right and be easy and so I could ride my horse and spend time with her like I've been wanting to do this one thing try a new saddle on her one thing for a whole week now and I just seems like I can never get it together and do the things that I want and I know I'm being dramatic but sometimes you gotta be dramatic you guys I give up. I literally give up. I give up. I give up.
That's a wrap. I'm sorry, Penny. Once this cold snap disappears, it's you and me. Okay? I promise. It's nice out today. Won't yeah, it's so me? nice. It's so nice outside. Oh, because I have a tissue box. All right, let's go see. Right, yep. That's the kind of fun you're missing if you're not in Canada. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the